What's going on guys? Welcome back to Mike's Poketube where the openings never stop. Today we are doing a very, very, very special opening. The mass of this thing is crazy. You guys will be able to tell by the way that it does not fit into my screen. See, I'm hitting the back of my stand here. Now this is, I will try and back this up for a second, the Mew and Mewtwo Premium Collection box, guys. This is gonna be a two-part opening for sure. This box is gigantic, and we will get into it, show you all the contents inside, and then we will open up the packs. What we will probably do is show you the contents today, open up the five packs today, and then the next video will be five packs. And the way it's gonna work out is this one will be aired today, and the second video will be shown on Saturday, because on Friday we have our pack battle for Havoc against PokeX. I just want to make sure I set this up right. Give me a second, guys. Okay, I think we got it. So we're going to open this thing up with our pen. Again, because I don't have... Whoops. Because I don't have my keys on me. Anyways, we got a good spot opened up, so let's begin. I want to get through as much of this as quickly as possible because this thing is gigantic. Wow, man. I was not expecting the size of this box, guys. Wait till you guys see this thing opened up. Wow. Okay. So we're going to just take the top off here. Like this thing, right? Just the top is... Wow, man. This is incredible, guys. Now inside here, we have... Give me a second. It's really going to be hard to open this whole thing on camera, but you have your 10 Generations Packs, the Mew and Mewtwo EX promo cards, which are only available in this box. And from what I've seen, most stores are only getting three boxes, so it's going to be pretty rare. And 10 Packs of Generations. Now, I'll probably be one of the only people to admit this, but in my mind, I feel like Pokemon went a little cheap on this. I do feel like they, they could have added some sleeves or something, maybe 15 packs. After all, it is the blowout of the year. But we have an illustration collection booklet, so we'll look at that for a second. Alright guys, so here is the illustration booklet. It goes through all the art of the Pokemon TCG. And I guess there's a lot of reading in it, to be honest. It's explaining all the art and what they do to make the photos, etc. What years they came out in, who the artists were. Very, very cool. I'm actually really interested to read this, to be honest. I still feel they could have given a little more t on the TCG side, but at the same time, it's not bad, guys. Ten packs of generations should hold some goods. We also get not one, not two, but three, whoops, but three packs to hold our cards in. See that? There's a Charizard, a Venusaur, and a Blastoise. Very cool. So, without further ado, let's open up the cards and see what we got there. This is probably going to be an 8 or 9 minute video, and the second part will be about 5, so it's going to be long, and I knocked the card over in the background. Oops. <laughs> As you can tell, this is a little bit big for my table, guys. We're going to open this up. The, the code card that's in this set, guys, I'm telling you right now, I am probably going to keep it. <laughs> So I'm going to go and pull out two or three code cards to give to you guys, but it will be throughout the video. Just let me get this all emptied out. We'll be right back. Oh, uh, you also have dividers. Very cool. We'll let Mew and Mewtwo stand in front this time around. They look pretty cool.
All right, guys, so as I was saying, I will replace those code cards. There will be a couple that will pop up throughout the video. There are those Mew and Mewtwo cards. They look absolutely fantastic, guys. Absolutely ridiculous. I'm going to sleeve them up now because I don't want them getting damaged at all. I have a feeling these cards are going to hold a premium in the future. Wow. I might even get them graded down the road. That is very cool. They're textured. They're really, really cool art. They just have everything, you know? So here we are. Two of them all sleeved up, looking really, really nice. I'm going to keep them in their own separate space. And we are going to start this. I will give out a code card to start. It's a Primal Clash code card, guys. Best of luck, whoever gets it. All right, so we're gonna take the first five packs off the top here. There's five packs. The other five we'll put aside for the next video. So we have, and I'll move Mew because he kind of flew away. And it's kind of fitting he's up front for this. We're starting with a Venusaur pack, by the way, guys. Hopefully this holds the goods because we did pay a lot for this box. And there are some cards we are missing in the set. We have a Pikachu. We have an Energy, a Darkness Energy, a Slowpoke, a Paris, a Geodude, a Charmander, a Haunter, a Max Revive, a Dedenne is our Radiant Collection card, a Hitmonlee is our regular rare. That's not the way to start something that we paid this much for, guys. <laughs> anyway, next up we have a Pikachu pack. Very cool. Pikachu is our favorite and usually brings us some luck. Oops. Almost put three behind two. All right, so we have a Metal Energy, a Pikachu again, a Clefairy, a Meowth, a Gulpin, a Golbat, an Olympia, a Reverse Pokemon Fan Club, a Gardevoir EX Full Art. There you go, we got an EX and a Gengar Hollow again, guys. <laughs> we did pull that a couple days ago. For the some of you will remember that. It was out of our Pikachu box. Just give me a second to sleeve them up. We will be on the road. Next up is a Blastoise pack. Oh boy, I just felt something. It's going to be a good card. <sighs> Matchup. We have a Fighting Energy, a Meowth, a Magmar, a Swablu. A Mr. Mime, a Cloyster, a Machamp Reverse, which is kind of cool. A Jirachi is our Radiant Collection card. And our rare is a Zapdos. Again, guys, that is our second Zapdos. Very cool. Oh, man, that's a very nice card. Hopefully, we can get an Articuno or another Mega Charizard EX out of the 10. Anyways, guys, next up, we have another Venusaur pack. Let's see if we can pull something else that was, that's good. Alright guys, so we have a Ponyta, a Magikarp, a Grass Energy, a Diglett, a Swablu, a Golbat, an Olympia, a Reverse Olympia, a Floetti, and our rare in the pack is a Doug Trio. so nothing major out of that. Now we have our last pack of the five, which is a Pikachu pack. Maybe he'll give us some luck. If not, then I would say the goods of this pack should be in the next five packs. All right, guys, so we have a Meowth, a Slowpoke, a Tangla, a Rhyhorn, a Snorunt, a Metapod, a Maintenance, a Snorlax Reverse, a Sylveon EX Full Art, which is pretty awesome. I can't deny that. And we have a Snorlax Regular Rare. So give me a second. I'm going to sleeve him up. We'll do a quick recap, and then we will cut this off until the Part 2 episode. Alright guys, 
So, what we, what we pulled in the first five packs, we got a Sylveon EX Full Art, a Zapdos Full Art again. Both of those are duplicates. This is my first Gardevoir EX, which is pretty cool on its own. Then we got a Gengar Hollow. And we also had, which I don't know what I did with them. Ah, here they are. A Mewtwo and Mew EX promo card that look absolutely amazing, guys. I think those and the figurine are going to be worth so much in the next couple years. I'm, I'm really going to take care of those two cards. So you guys know what it is. If you like this video, slap that like button. It helps us grow and I appreciate it. Also, don't forget to comment in the comment section below. Let me know what you thought about the box. This is the biggest box of the year, guys. This thing is going to blow up. I know it is. I, I'm looking to get myself a second one of these just to keep sealed and put away. But let me know what you thought about the box. Let me know what you thought about the polls. Let me know if you think that the next five packs are going to bring the goods. Because we did get some pretty cool cards there, but we didn't get the goods. You know what I mean? The Zapdos was the goods, but he was the only one. And also, guys, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, make sure you do. At the time that I'm filming this, it probably will be different now. But there are only seven subscribers until we reach our subscriber giveaway. Now that's pretty awesome guys. You guys should enjoy that. So thank you. I appreciate all the support. I can't believe we're even at 243. Thank you for this guys. I appreciate this so much. Um, yeah, that's it. So don't forget to subscribe and be part of that giveaway guys. All right, I'll catch you next time.